we are in this park for a very special reason. We're going to do a Bangra class. Oh my God, excited. <laughs> are you ready for it? Come on. Come on, keep it rolling. Do you think exercise can now be fun? Yes, definitely. I've done 7,251 steps and I think I've burned around 300 calories and I'm excited. When I first met Adam, there were some serious health concerns I had. His cholesterol was higher than what it should have been. His blood pressure was on the high side as well. And he had really low self-esteem. You're really funny, you're really charming, you've got so much going for yeah. you. It, it pains me that you can't see it and all your friends will see it. I think you underestimate how they feel about you as well. I don't think they see what you feel. Yep. It's so glaringly obvious how brilliant and amazing you are. Yep. And you just can't see it. Not yet, no. no. Not at the minute. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's okay. Now I'm hoping the results I give him today will make him feel more positive about things. Hi there. Hi, Adam. How are you doing? I'm good, thank you. Yourself? I'm good. You're looking amazing. <laughs> thank you. Now, Adam, in the last eight weeks, you've managed to lose seven inches off your waist. Wow. Yeah. So, really impressive. Yeah. All your results are heading in the right direction. Yeah. If this was a patient consultation I was having, you know, with one of my regular patients, yeah. and they had made that progress in eight weeks, I'd be giving them a gold star. <laughs> so Good. consider yourself having a gold star. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I've come to meet Helen in a park today because I understand earlier this week, somebody verbally abused her while she was out exercising. But I don't want that to put her off. I want to show her that exercise can still be fun. You can do it outdoors in groups and I've got a special surprise for her. I go out on my lunch break for about 20 minutes and just out of nowhere, just somebody just shouted out to me, oi, fatty. And it, it really did upset me at the time. It's unacceptable. It's nothing to do with you. It's all about the person who said it and how they feel about themselves. So, so please don't let them jeopardise your future. I feel like I, I should have had a T-shirt like, you know, I may be fat, but I am trying sort of thing. Uh, OK, fabulous. OK. <laughs> and we are going to go for a walk in the park yeah. because exercise can be as simple as that. Ready? Fabulous, thank you. <laughs> Just hope it's big enough. That looks great. Now, Helen, I've got one more surprise for you. OK. Look this way. Helen's friends, family and local walking club are here to support her. And we're all going to go on a walk together. Let's do it. <laughs> Come on, Helen. It's nice to know that there are people out there that we've all got a common aim. I'm out there to try and get myself fitter, so why should I be ashamed?